All right, all right, we're back. We're back again. <coughs> well, I want to show you a little quick ditty. You know, we've been hammering them this weekend. Um, we're going to show you how to twist the dice to the right. We haven't showed you that one yet. I don't believe we're going to show you how to twist them to the right. We're going to be using a super grip. We're just going to get to throw, and then we'll show you um, after we're done. we got the camera set up so you can... You know, start off with that view. It's important to see the dice twisting that way to the right. Danger song. Underground craps. Helping you develop your arm, baby. That's right. That's what we're doing for free. Five, four, three, five. <coughs> in a way where it'll make them kick kick in if you haven't watched our video how to kick make the dice kick go back and watch it it's, it's huge but we're not trying to make them do that but uh when they but we are throwing in a way to make them do that and twist to the right that's another one kicking six three nine six three nine you know, and you just want to, you know, they don't have to, you know, be one piece, but ultimately that's your goal is to have them one piece rolling, you know, bending to the right, twisting to the right. So this is a definitely a twisted shot. Now watch them twist. Watch them twist. We'll try to keep them together real good. You see that? Kept them together. Twist it up. Four, deuce, six. Point. Four, deuce, six. Point. You see him twisting to the right on that one? Oh yes, oh yes. That's what we're showing you today, how to twist the dice to the right. <clears throat> okay, we'll just keep on rolling there. A couple more this way here. You see we threw it out that way and they were still twisting. See, and they came off, ran over, three, deuce, five. It's our new point. It's our new point. Okay, it's another free crafts lesson. How to helping you become dangerous as well. <clears throat> Increasing the population. We're expanding. We want people to have great success. Nice kick. Four, two, six. Again, like I said in the other video, um, when you make them kiss, it, it, some people call it kissing. I call it kicking because they actually kick. They land from off from off twisting in the air. They land. They land. Pass line, then they'll kick. You know, they'll kick. You know, they'll like boom and they'll dump down because that twisting, because that kicking, one will stop, and then the other one like run in, or they'll both V in, which I covered that in my last video. Our last uh, video, uh, free craps training lesson. <clears throat> okay, one more, then we'll change the view. Over to the left. Twelve. Or, er, hold on. Yo. <laughs> Sorry. Yo. See down there. Well, this one might, and it's hung up. I'm trying to, ah, there it goes, whatever. Get a little spinner on me there. Okay, now we'll change the camera. Oh shit, oops, there we go. So you can see how we're throwing this. We are using a super grip claw. 5435 die set. We're using a super grip claw. 5435 die set. You'll see we're grabbing on the inside of the dice. Grabbing on the inside. Like this. Boom. We're twisting. We're twisting. Now normally the dice, they leave our hands. And like this, they would be twit, you know, they would be twisting through the air, corkscrewing, you know, hanging around in the air like this, twisting, 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 this way, counterclockwise. But this time we're actually going to be throwing it the same way, throwing the same way, but they're going to twist clockwise. <clears throat> okay, 
Okay, so we change the camera view here on this one so you can see the hand set up. It's another kiss. Ho, oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. Yes, yeah, so making them kiss is uh, definitely shows. If you can do this though right here, that will show a level of achievement. Let's just put it that way. A level of achievement. You know, this and that kick shot. You see that kick shot? Oh, ho. Oh. I wish I had the damn camera down there for that one. That thing hit about two, three inches out from the pass line, stopped and went like that, pushed the other one forward, the other one came back. So, you know. And, oh, damn it. See how that spun on me? But uh, the casino. I don't think they're going to like that too much. You know, you want to try to get both of them to go in, but, you know, that's why I said you, uh, in another video, in the kick video, you don't want to show that, like I said, that you don't want to show that too much. You don't want to just sit there and bang them and bang them and let them know that, you know, you can keep making the dice do that same thing I keep doing over and over, over and over. See what I'm saying? It's, that, that really shows a degree, a certain, a certain level of, of skill, of achieved skill, okay, and it's a high level, it's a high level, okay, so I don't know anyone that's making the dice do that, I've never seen anyone show that, you know, I'm not, you know, bragging or any shit like that, I'm just saying that I've never seen anyone make the dice kick, kiss, kick, whatever you want to call it, <clears throat> but I do, because I like it, it's a shot there, and we got to have it, another kick, three, one, oh, three, one, oh. Is that three in a row? I was talking, so I don't know. Is it three? You know, so anyway, so you've seen the setup. Now let's take you in. Let's take you in. Just keep on moving here. Keep on moving. Don't stop. No. You guys remember that song? Keep on moving. Keep on moving. Don't stop. No. I have to come in with that song. Let's move this back here so you can see there. <coughs> Check out some landing. So this is a pass line throw. We're landing at the pass line. We're looking to kick them in. And when you do it right, they'll come in and they'll land and they'll go. <coughs> they'll just hit, dip down. One, a lot of times one will stay. The other one will run in. You know, get kicked in. And it'll stay up there or get pushed, pushed out. So it's a really, really nice shot, man. <coughs> Sunday transmission. See the kick. <clears throat> Partial kick. Five, three, eight. That was a partial. I mean, it was just such a, just a, you know, like, it was weird because they came in, like, looked like they were, like, landing, like, like this, you know, they just barely, partially kissed. And then you could realize the bounciness of the table. <coughs> See, we threw it well short, but we didn't have the spin on it. You got to get, you know, when you throw it out here before, beyond, uh, before the pass line, you're throwing this shot, you want to make sure you get enough spin that way. That way it'll make them, boom, it'll make them, like, Velcro to the table. They just, you know, run in, you know, or stop right there, so. <clears throat> okay, there's another kick. <clears throat> two, two. And those got up a little bit because we didn't have the correct amount of spin. So it's about having the correct amount of spin with the kick if you use the kick. Because the kick's going to give it a hard shot. It's going to make it shoot hard out of there. And it's going to make it shoot out of there, hard out of there, and the other one's going to stop and shop. No kick. Oh, deuce, six. They were, oh, oh, damn it. They were, you've seen that, guys. They were all so close to each other so close and I didn't get enough spin on them to make them do you know how I really wanted to do on that but.
Jeez. You see that one? You see that? Did you see how they sprayed? It went, it went boom, landed, and went like that. That's the shot. That's the shot. Because it makes them land and flat, and then they just go boom like that. It happens so fucking fast, but they're not rolling. They're like sliding. You understand what I'm saying? Dude, this is a high level shot, man. This is a high level shot. This is a very, and you can see that one right there. See that? Right here, we'll pull it in. Right here. 314. See that right there? That's what this shot's going to give you, right here, guys. That's what it's going to give you. You know, when you, you know, and I'm not even like trying hard. I'm just, you know, kind of lofting them out there a little bit, throwing that way, throwing that way in a way where, because see if it, uh, you know, where I'm just a fraction off. I just, you know, I'm not laser fo I'm not, I am not laser focused on throwing that shot. I'm just only throwing a shot very close, trying to, you know, throw a shot close to it, but not trying to make them kick. But they are kicking because I'm keeping it so close in that range, which is positive because you're getting to see a lot of them kick, a lot of them kick. And that one right there is what this shot's about. They kicked and they just flattened and they spread, they spread out. That's what's going to do for you. And the reason being it spreads is because they kick and they just fly, they slide. They just slide across. They slide. They don't roll and they might do some spinning, but they're flat. They're like there together and then they go like that when they do that what you just seen them do that's what you want to do now we use the super grip like I said uh, like that just like that you know so I'm going to turn the pip around where you can see the pip it's easier like if I do with the sixes right here so you can see what's going on see and I grab the front pip see right there I grab the back pip shit Anyhow, the whole point is, is I'm on the left side, I'm on the inside of the dice. I'm on the inside of the dice, and I've got the claw grip. Rolling with my fingers on the inside of the dice, up, and turn. Up, turn. Normally, you'd think, normally, rather, it would turn this way, counterclockwise. But because of our hand placement, on the inside of the dice, it's making the dice go clockwise. Heavy spin, five, one, six. I mean, that was a heavy spin. And with a kiss, kick, kick. Some will say they're kissing. I say that it kicks because it's it's intentional. You know, I know that I'm going to be close. And if, you know, I'm pretty close, they're going to land like that and naturally give me that kick. And if they don't kick, they're naturally with the correct spin enough rotation. And you'll, you'll figure out the rotation. It's not slow. You want a little more... A little bit better than slow. And this one, you know, you can get it sped, uh, sped up a little bit. Get a little more speed on that where it spins on this way clockwise. Not counter, but clockwise. Remember? And they're going to be flying through the air like this. Flying through the air like that. Spinning. Counterclockwise. Like that. The land, boom. They're land. They're spinning. The land, boom, like that. And it's like it gets... Pew, Boom! It's boom like that, and this one settles down, or they'll both flatten and run in V, or go like you know out to the side, or V in, want to stop, want to roll forward, or you might get want to stop, want to chop up a little bit, come down, or you you know not hit them, and both them will you know not have enough twist on it, so bounce, and, you know get up on the wall a little bit. It's okay though. It's okay. Let's mark that six. All right though. So that's the lesson today, uh, Sunday. That's just you know a little 16. No reason to keep beating a uh, horse in the head. That's that's all you need right there, gang. That is all you need right there. That's all you need. Well, I guess all we need is a 10 and a a 12, and we'd have the uh, all tall small. But um, yeah. So anyway, two four six. Ugh. Two four six sixes, four fours. Total of uh, 16 rolls, man. Uh, that's not bad. Ten rolls between the two, and uh, you know those fours. I think I had three in a row. 
But anyway, though, so mind the twist, mind the twist, mind the twist. <clears throat> Remember, we used a 5435 die set Sunday transmission, helping you build this up, baby. This whole thing, this whole thing. This is your money maker. That's your money maker right here. This is your money maker. This is your money maker right here. I'm just trying to tell you. And this one actually should be too. This one should be too. You should have both of them. You should have both of them going. Get both of them going. Okay? I'm just telling you, that's a huge lesson. We'll get into lessons about how to develop your left hand and throwing left handed, you know, because obviously I can. I've showed you that. I don't pull it out much, but, you know, my right hand's a little bit, whatever. We'll put out a video of that kind of thing because we do use it. You know what I mean? It is a factor. You might have one arm go down, you know, because uh, arthritis or whatever, you know, I don't know, your shoulder might be whatever, and you might have to set up you know with your left hand so you know it's good to start developing your uh, left hand now start working on it now when it's weak and whatever you know start off with the you know premier BS you know whatever you want you know premier and that's a you know easy one to start off with it's just easy to start off with kind of thing and then work up you know go to super grips that kind of thing super grips aren't really you know hard to throw you know make sure when you're landing it try to you know get it about two inches out and try to have like a little tilt you know when it lands you try to have a little tilt when it lands about two inches out. See what I'm saying? So you want about, you know, have it like a little tilt. See how it's not flat? Try to have it like that, about two inches out. Bam. Bam. Two inches out. That's a huge lesson. That's huge. So, uh, five, four, three, five uh, set today for this lesson. Free craps. Now, here's uh, free craps training. Now, with the bigger dice, you'll see how my fingers, see how there's a pip. Oh shit, my thumb, big fingers. But anyway, see, I got that pip too. I'm on the right side of the dice, is what my whole. I can't see that's fucking showing me that, man. Anyway, we're on the right side of the dice. We're on the right side of the dice, ripping the dice, you know, clawing the dice, you know, putting the, putting the claw down, okay? On the inside of the dice. And what we're doing with that claw, we're taking them, launching them like an airplane. See that? We're not inline. This is not an inline throw. No, no, no. <clears throat> we don't even have an inline throw in the repertoire right now, okay? To be quite honest. I mean, we've got one, but it's not, you know, whatever. We don't get into that right now. So it's not an inline throw. It's not this this thing. You know, we throw a lot of rainbow looping shots. We get the dice going up, just like an airplane taking off. See, just like an airplane taking off, taking off, turn it. Airplane taking off, taking off, turn it. Okay, so that's what we were doing. That's what we we're doing. Boom, turned it. And now, normally, you would think that the dice, since we're doing all that, the dice would go this way. No, no, no. The dice are actually going rotating the other way. We hope the video was able to catch that, gang. <clears throat> five, four, three, five dice set. Appreciate your time. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and roll on out. Wall hitter, got a wall hitter. Wall hitter, we can't be, can't leave on that note from the wall hitter. Five, four, three, five, set. With the kiss, roll in, three, deuce, five. You see that? They V'd out. You see that V out? Right here. They're right here. Yeah, my next place it'll be, you know. I guess the next place I'll have to fucking bend over and pick the shit up, man. Ha <laughs> uh ha, -huh, it's funny. I have to bend over because I won't have this wall here where it hits and then, you know, that's an out. You know, we're not going to, because you know the dice, they bounce way fucking up. I mean, they're going to bounce out. You know, I mean, they're going to bounce in someone's lap. So, whatever with that. That was another point on that one. Or point, rather. Second point. Okay, we're just rolling out, gang. Rolling out. We'll see you next time. We'll see you next time. Have an awesome day. Remember this roll. Play it back. Share it. Got a kiss. Five, one. Sixes have just been getting murdered on this side video. They've been getting murdered on this one.
Got a kiss. See where they landed. See that? The V out. Up against the wall right there. 415. Big spin, 10, 10. Big spin, and you see what they did? They landed, since we were throwing here, they landed and they went that way. So you could see how the spin affected the dice, and they landed, they're spinning, and they just ran into the wall and stopped. Six four ten gives us the uh, small, gives us the small. Okay, those actually kissed off the wall. That was what I call a kiss. That was a yo. Why well, couldn't have been a 12? be it. That'd be it. Appreciate your time, gang. It was a rollout. Four, three, seven out. That's the way it worked. So if we got 23, 23 in the way to be. Or stick. A little 23. Three, twisted shot. Okay, so we set it up. We're gonna roll out. Actually, roll out this time. Long video, I know. Important video. See how we're setting them up. Back, release. And they spun. It was a horrible one, horrible roll, but I mean, still did what they were supposed to do. The one bounced in. You know, they weren't anywhere close, though. You know, so. And then we'll get up here so you can actually see the release. Right here, we'll try to do a good one. We're not even setting the dice. We're just going to throw it so you can see the actual, try to catch the rotation of the dice through there. I think that's so important. See them turn over there? They're turning. <clears throat> Show another one. Looks like they catch me. Just in case of uh, didn't catch it during the video. See them turning? They're turning. Try to keep them tight together now. Try to keep them really tight together here. We're not trying to make them kiss. We're just trying to make them turn. Show you the turn. See, we got a kiss and a turn. Turning with a kiss. So, okay, gang. That's how we did it. It's a hard ass roll to say 23. Hey, whatever. Like I said, just another day in the office. Showing you another free craps lesson. Actually rolling. Hey, appreciate your time. 5435 CK Danger Song. Underground craps. Showing you how to get this built up and do what you just seen today. And that's what it's all about from Danger Song, gang. We'll see you next time. Appreciate your time, gang. Have an awesome day. Sunday today. Remember, minimum one hour a day practice. One hour a day practice. If you want to be nasty, two to three. If you want to be dangerous, hang around three for several months. Practice a day. Several months. Practice a day. See you next time.